from what you saw last night between mm-hmm. the Sixers and Brooklyn, mm-hmm. the way we've seen KD and Kyrie offensively perform, forget mm-hmm. the forget the records and the standings. Is Brooklyn mm-hmm. the best team in the East? I'm not ready to say that just yet because um, we all know Milwaukee still, you know, I'm, I'm always the type that believe that, you know, to be the best, you got to beat the best. And right now, I mean, Milwaukee holds the title right now, you know what I mean? So um, if I see them do it against them, okay, cool. But as of right now, uh, it's a step in the right direction. But as far as with the East Coast, you still got to go through Milwaukee. And then there's this narrative with Miami. And I don't, you know, I'm going to go ahead and get out of the way. Y'all treat Miami like they're Detroit from when it was Ben Wallace and the boys <laughs> there. Like, y'all act like, like that's the same team. I really have a problem with that. Miami has improved it. I mean, look, I give all the credit to Eric Spolstra, right? Great coach. You know what I'm saying? Um, fair to say, I don't know how much coach you have to do when you have LeBron and a prime D Wade, but that's a whole nother other story. You know what I'm saying? And Chris Bosh. And Chris Bosh. You know, we can't never forget about him. And a Hall of Famer in Ray. See, look, see, see, there, there we go. Yes. So, <laughs> go I, hate. I, I'm not so sold on Miami that I feel like they're, they're going to scare anybody. They have the depth, but do you think that scares, like the scares Brooklyn? No, absolutely not. I don't know, man, because at the end of the day, maybe not Brooklyn specifically, because KD is a dog. I think Kyrie is a dog, but Miami blue collar, they tough. You know, PJ Tucker, Bam mm-hmm. out of a day or Jimmy Butler. Mm-hmm. They they will instill some fear in certain teams when you talk about a seven game series when it all, you know, count the most. That's a fact. That's, That's a why fact. I picked Miami to go to the finals because of their grittiness. That's a fact. You still got to score. True. You know what I'm saying? And True. I like Oladipo. Oladipo, you know, uh, been getting kind of hurt. You know, he ain't the same Oladipo. You know what I mean? And right. I like I like Jimmy. And Jimmy, like, you know, very tough, very good leader. You know, leave it all on line. I love the way Jimmy play, man. But, man, sometimes the talent just, you know, and then when you get to work behind it, it just it's just different. Jimmy so, offensively to me can't get it done consistently. Like you mm-hmm. can get a game or two out of Jimmy on the offensive t- on the on the offensive note where he'll drop 40. That's a there, fact. But he can't consistently do it, I've seen to win a series that matters. So yeah. He's they'll one of those guys you. that's always gonna need help. They'll bother you. I I will admit that. And Bam, Bam still is an infant to me. He still hasn't gotten to where his talent, his his upside truly is yet to me. So we'll 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 see we'll see how they mature, man. But I'll tell you this: uh, when you got a killer and Kyrie and KD, you get them in that mode. It's just hard. It's it's gonna be hard to deal with, man. You see and, what they did to James Harden last night, yo? They had Harden shook last night, bro, from the tip off, yo. I'm watching the way KD. Shoving into him, pushing him. I'm watching how Kyrie pushing him, stealing the ball, knocking the ball out of his hands. Like, yeah, complaining. They, they went for Harden last night, y'all. Yeah. He and he did not help with that poor shooting performance. Mm-mm. Nah, he he got he got a. Uh, I will say, I, I don't think he expected Kyrie to come out in the way that he did. And I think people really overlooked how much of a, of a competitor Kyrie really is. Best point you guard in the saying? NBA. He proved it last night to me, bro. Yeah, and same thing with uh with KD. And I'm like, y'all, y'all. I mean, everybody's act like KD just can't play defense. Like he's capable of playing defense. It's his frame. Right. And he's dealing with these taller guys. You saw. I mean, he did what he what he tried to do against Embiid. Of course, Embiid moved him out the way. But I mean, yeah, you know, it is what it is. He he's he's capable of doing it. He's willing to do that. Which a lot of offensive players not in this day and age will not do. Yeah. So you know that's that's championship grit, and a, a lot of, uh, like I said, we we we're gonna see how how it turns. Cleveland Cavaliers select LeBron James. Denver Nuggets select Carmelo Anthony. Anthony for three. Now on my damn. Receiver. 
expect to. We we're both going into our 19th season. I mean, that's that's very. There's not too many people that can say that.